again on well this is the Sesame Street sign what you notice something different about it yeah there are some letters missing from the words Sesame Street what do you suppose those letters are what could be could be well let's see let's see what's missing under here ah, there's a letter E there's another letter E. There's another one. And another one. So all the letters E were missing from the words Sesame Street. One there, one there, one there, and one there. You know, the letter E is a very important letter in the words Sesame Street. Well, it's time for my nap. You know, naps are nice things, especially if you've got a nice, big, soft, cuddly, fluffy pillow here, like I do. And I do. Uh, so, <coughs> just climb into <coughs> bed here. Nice, big, cuddly, soft, fluffy pillow. Shh. Come here. Come here. What was that? What was that? It sounded like the uh, the bell of a fire engine. Huh. Well, I'll go to the window and see if that was a fire engine going. Ah, pillow. One second thought. Ah. If it was a bell of the fire engine, I'd still be hearing it. So I guess it wasn't on a fire engine. So I can go back to... <coughs> My nap again. <sighs> oh, the bell again, the bell again. Maybe it was the telephone. The telephone. I will go answer the telephone. <laughs> but if it was the telephone, Bert would have answered it. So it wasn't the telephone, which means I can go back to my nap and my knife. Big, soft, fluffy pillow. <laughs> the doorbell, the doorbell, must be the doorbell. I will go answer the doorbell. Pillow. Pillow. Nobody was at the door. Hey! What are you doing? What? What are you doing with my pillow? Oh, nice, big, cuddly, soft pillow. I know it's a nice, oh. big, cuddly, soft pillow, but that's my nice, big, cuddly, soft pillow, and you've got to oh. give it back to me. I want the pillow. I want the pillow. Oh, the pillow. Oh, 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 the pillow. Okay, I, I tell you what. What? How about this? What? Suppose we share it. Share yeah. You know, share. You know what that means. Oh, that, share. That means, that means you take half and I take half. Oh, Okay. 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 I have half. Yeah. And you have half. Yeah, but... Oh, nom, nom. oh, oh, what? Here you have. Yeah, but... Oh, oh. Yeah, but... Oh, it's good. Eat, eat, eat. Yeah. Oh, good. But... Oh, boy. Oh, 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 pillow. Oh, pillow. Oh, fluffy. Oh, oh, how you like it? Oh, 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 good. Oh, Hey, what's Oh, look at this. Somebody broke my vase that I just fixed. Uh, it was this. Oh, the baseball broke it. Now, I wonder where this could have come from. Maybe it comes from over there. Hmm. Let's go check it out, see if there's anybody over here. See who this belongs to, huh? Oh, uh, hi, Louise. Why, hello hey, there. Hey, you Big haven't Bird. seen my, um, um... Yeah? Um, Your ball? Listen, uh, Big Bird, uh, this baseball 
was lying over there in front of my fix-it shop. Oh, yeah, well, really? Right next to a uh, broken vase that I had just fixed. Now, uh, you wouldn't happen to know where this baseball came from, would you? Um, well, um... Uh, uh-huh. Well, um, Louise? Yeah? What if there was a, um, uh, juggler on Sesame Street? Uh, and this juggler, see? Well... A juggler on Sesame Street, eh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, well, uh, uh Luis, uh, how's this idea? What if there was a, um, maybe there was a block party? A block right party. here on Sesame Street. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Step right up. Three balls for a quarter. Break the vase and win a teddy bear. Here comes a little lady now. One quarter, please. Thank you very much, ma'am. Good luck. All right, there she goes. Wind up and... She broke it! She wins a teddy bear! Congratulations, little lady! Yeah, well, Big Bird, now wait a minute. Now, all of these things could have happened. Yes. Yeah, yeah they could have. They yes, really they could have. But wait a minute. Now, you're standing here in front of us, and you have in your hand a baseball glove and a baseball bat. Oh, well, you those see. are those are nothing. Yeah. I mean, I was just... Mm-hmm. Uh, I... They just happen to and this, be in my hand. Mm-hmm. Um, that happens to be my ball. Hmm. I'm sorry, Louise, but I was having fun, you know, with batting practice, and I kind of batted one right over there. And yeah, well, it's okay. Don't worry about it, Big Bird. It just sort of broke your vase. I heard a clinkle tinkle. You did, right. Hey, yeah. Well, don't, don't worry about it. Listen, <sighs> I fixed that vase one time. I can fix it again. You can? Just be very careful with the ball, okay? Okay. Okay. Uh, we'll I'll really be now. careful how I break that again. I mean, I won't. I mean, I'll, I'll really be careful. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thank you for you being honest. You won't have to worry about me anymore. You're telling me Don't about it. Me. Okay. Mm. Honesty is the best policy. Once upon a time in the land of eight, there stood a castle very great, and eight flags waved in the air, for the king of eight had put them there. I'm the king of eight, and I'm here to state that everything here has to total eight. The guards, for instance, by the gate, must always number exactly eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. In my castle and back of me are eight windows you can see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. In those windows are my daughters. Show yourselves, my dears. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Each daughter has a silver crown with eight jewels going round. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I love eight. Eight is great. Eight is the number I do not wait. Important news comes from the queen and the new baby, and I have seen that she is well and doing fine. Good grief, it's princess number nine. Up, I guess. Oh, hello, bird. <gasps> oh, I see you have your bat and baseball. Yeah. Would you like to play a game of baseball with me? Well, I would really love to, but you know what happened? I already broke a vase over at the fix-it shop, and oh. Luis was kind of cross. Well, why not stand over there and hit the ball in the opposite direction? You mean... Oh, that would be all right. I don't see how we could get over there then. Right. Okay. Let me okay. see. Oh, yes, you put the ball down because I can pick it up easier with my snuffle. Then. Oh, okay. I'll put it down here for... There. Okay. Okay? Wow. Okay, Bird. Now, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready to batter up. Okay. Here I go with my famous snuffle pitch. Get it right over here. Here we go. I'm not going to hit it hard. I don't want to break any windows either. Oh. Uh, 
What's it doing? I oh, never dear. saw... I think I put too much spin on my snuffle pitch. I'd best go home and practice. See you later, bird. Yeah, but, but, but Mr. Snuffle, because the ball is still spinning around. Um. But, what? <laughs> oh, no, not again. Hmm. <laughs> I think I hear my mother calling me. Hmm. Um, maybe I should run? Maybe I could hide somewhere. Hey, uh, Pajaro, wait a minute. Uh, hey. Um, are you talking to me, oh. Luis? Uh, oh, uh, I didn't do it. If you're thinking it's me, I mean, it really isn't my fault, you see. Mr. Snuffleupagus was here. Who? Mr. Snuffleupagus. Oh, come on, Big. Yeah. We're not him again. No, well, it's true. And he pitched his famous snuffy um, ball pitch. And it's snuffy kind ball. of wild because it went around and around. And then finally, after uh -huh. a while, uh -huh. Uh -huh. it went over and... Yeah, right. Snuffy ball, huh? Yeah. Well, that's the craziest thing I've ever heard in my life, Big Bird. Now, this time, you're coming with me, and you're going to help me fix this base. Now, come on. But, but, but... <sighs> Look, Fred, I've sent for you because I want you to go out there and bring me back a 20. A what? A 20. What's a 20? A 2 and a 0 together. A 2 and a... 0. Together. together. Go out and get me one. Right, boss. Aha! Not that. That's 11. Hmm? No, that's a 12. Now get out of here and get me a 20. <laughs> Thirteen. Forty. I'm on the trail now. Cute looking kid. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Aha. Fifteen. A clue. I must be getting warmer. What's that? A guy running in this weather? Sixteen. Go look into this. Seventeen. Wait! I got it. He's going to eighteen. Now I'm really getting hot. Nineteen. Well, this is it. Mm, a gorilla! Oh, 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 is the word round, okay? The word today is round. Now, I'd like to show you what uh, round is. Hmm. Unfortunately, there's nothing round around here. Hey, you guys, send in something round, would you? Okay, now that is perfect, because now we have a ball. And a ball, as you can all plainly tell, is a nice round shape. See, it's all sort of nice and even, and curved and sort of like a circle, you know? Now, because a ball is round, it can roll, and it can spin, and it can bounce. And it can sing tiptoe through the tulips. And it can sing tiptoe through the, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute, who said that? Uh, hold on, hold on here. What's the matter, you right here, old MacDonald had a farm? No, I would not. Now, yeah. uh, you, sir, are a rubber ball. So? Well, rubber balls can't talk. Neither can frogs. Well, uh, <clears throat> I don't really know what to say to that. Just continue the lesson, old froggy teacher of mine. Uh, well, um, <clears throat> okay. Okay. Hmm. As I was saying now, a ball is round, so it can roll. You betcha we can. Oh, that's very good. Yeah, thank you. And not only can a ball roll, but it can also spin. 
Ah, very good spinning ball. Okay, not only can the ball spin and roll, but the ball can also bounce. Yeah, and the ball can also sing tiptoe through the tulips, through the tulips. Wait a minute, hold it, hold it, you. <laughs> what? Oh, listen, rubber balls aren't supposed to sing. Oh, yeah? Tell that to my brother. He was a big recording star. I don't believe it. Yeah, he was until a truck ran over him and squashed him out of shape. Oh? Yeah, now he's a football for the Green Bay Packers. How oh, will you stop that? <laughs> no, just cut that out. <laughs> hey, I got a lot of relatives, you know. Yeah, my Uncle Louie gained a lot of weight and became a bowling ball. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got a flock of little cousins who are Christmas tree ornaments. Listen, you. Come on now. I don't want to even hear about your relatives. Well, listen, stop that bouncing and come back here and sit down. Oh, I like or that. I'm going to flatten you against the wall. Hi, Daddy. Ah, Hi there, son. Hey, Dad, I'd like you to meet a friend of mine. Where'd he go? Who was he, boy? A frog. I was just talking to him a minute ago. Oh, don't be silly, son. Frogs can't talk. Yeah, I guess he's right. <laughs> A delicious piece of chocolate cake. Oh, I got some chocolate on the napkin there. Hey, Ernie. Oh, hi, Bert. Hi, hi, Ernie. Hey, listen, uh, you know, did you see what I got for our dessert tonight? Two pieces of chocolate. Two pieces? Hey. Huh? Hey, where's, where's the other piece of cake? Um, uh, uh, another piece of cake, Bert? Yeah. Um, you, you, you were saving it for dessert, Bert? Yeah, right. Where'd um, I put that? Was it sort of like this piece here, about the same size and shape? Yeah. Uh, and was it uh, sort of the same uh, rich chocolatey flavor as this piece here, Bert? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that piece of cake. Ernie. Yes? Uh, Ernie, what? Do you have in your hands? Uh, well, uh, <clears throat> nothing, Bert. See? Ernie? Ernie, yes, didn't Bert? you just have a fork in one hand and a napkin with some chocolate on it in the other? Huh? Yes, Bert. Yeah, and, and isn't this right here, right here, a plate full of chocolate cake crumbs? Huh? Uh, yes, I, I think so, Bert. Uh, Ernie? Mm-hmm. Uh, they're chocolate, all right. Look at me, Ernie. Hmm? You ate that cake. You ate it. Well, how can you say that, Bert? How can I say that? How can I say that? You had the fork, the plate, the napkin. Now, what other explanation could there possibly be? Well, uh, <sighs> let me think. Uh, yeah, you think. Well, well, well maybe. No, what? Now, now, maybe, Bert. Maybe yeah. I was just sitting here twiddling my thumbs when suddenly um, yeah? a monster came in, Bert. A monster? Yes, he was all sort of shaggy <sighs> and wild-eyed. And you see... He ate the cake. Yeah, sure. You know how monsters like cake, Bert. Ernie, what about the fork, huh? And the napkin? And the plate? Huh? Uh, Tell me about those. Well, let's see. Uh, 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 how about this? Now, maybe uh, just before he ate the cake, yeah. he sort of shook it over the plate and got the crumbs yeah. on the plate here. Uh, and, then he, and then he took a napkin and he wiped his mouth with it and he handed me the napkin. Yeah. And then he picked up a fork and he gave me the fork and then he walked out. How about that? It, you know, it, it could have happened that way, Bert. Oh, sure. Isn't that story just a bit far-fetched, Ernie? Just a bit? Well, I admit those are unusual things for a monster to do, but it, it could have happened oh, that sure. way, Bert. Oh, sure, sure, sure. It could have happened that way, Ernie. It could have happened. Could have happened. Ah. Well, it, it could have happened that way. It didn't happen that way. But it could have. Couldn't it? Doom, 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 doom. Hey. Oh. Cake. Well, what are you doing? Oh. How about... Listen. Oh, shake the crumbs, shake the crumbs. Want a clean cake? Clean cake. Nom, 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 nom. Yeah, but... Yeah, but that cake is... Mm. 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 Listen. Mm. That was pretty... Mm. 
This is the capital letter W. It's the first letter in the name Wilbur. <laughs> Excuse me one minute, please. <laughs> <laughs> As I was saying, that's the capital letter W. Hey! That's the capital letter W. It's a real big letter. Fish. I got a real hot one for you. We're looking for things that are round. You know what round is, don't you? Well? Mm-hmm. You're looking good. That's it. Now, that's round. Now, I want you to look for all the round things. You look at that. There's a, there's a cantaloupe, and there's a melon, and oh, my goodness. Look, oranges, and boy, there must be about a hundred round things out there, huh? Uh, my name is Kermit the Frog, and today we're going to do some exercises. And we're going to do some exercises with a couple of friends of mine named Harry and George, and they're bears. And uh, let's see, where's Harry? He's right there. Oh, there's Harry. Hey, Harry, how are you today? Where's George? Huh? Oh, there's George. Hi, George. How are you? Yeah, ready to do them? Okay. First exercise we're going to do is touch your toes. Okay? Ready, Harry? Harry, reach down and touch your toes. Okay? See, Harry's doing it. He's pretty good at it. Oh, Harry, we're going to have lunch later, okay? Yeah. Okay, now, George, are you doing this? George. Listen, George, these exercises are fun. Now, come on. Look at Harry do them. See how Harry does them. Harry's great at these exercises. Okay. Now, the first exercise we're going to do is we're all going to stretch, okay? Now, see how Harry stretches. Way to go, Harry. Wasn't that fun? Okay, everybody stretch one more time. There's old George. Okay, stretch. How did George get lunch? Okay, and the next thing we're gonna do is stretch our neck, like our friend Hubert, the polar bear here. Okay, stretch around there, Hubert. Everybody stretch around, twist around in circles. Right, that way, Harry, turn around in circles. Very good. And now, uh, what bad breath. Hey, listen, uh, next thing we're going to do is push-ups. And Harry, how are you gonna do some push-ups? Come on, Harry, Harry. Well, listen, if you guys aren't going to do push-ups, I'm going to leave. Goodbye. E. E. L. Eel. Jump, 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 jump. Jump, 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 jump. Jump, 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 jump. 
E. What is this again? The letter E. It's, it's small. A, it's a lowercase E. Right. It could be called small E, but it's really a lowercase E, right? Right. Okay. This is one way that an E can look. What's that? Hey. You hear something? Yeah. Sounds like there. our friend Skyride. Sure does. Wow. I wonder what he's going to do now. Wow. Wait, what's that? Looks like a number one. Yeah. Is that? Might be an F or a P. Could be. Could be or it could be a T. Yeah. It could be an a F. D. Looks like a stick. Oh, Looks like an E or a this. How about that? Oh, the great. There's a line on the bottom. Letter L. Yeah, that's an L. Could be an L. Could, it be, could be an E or a it, it could an be a square. Couldn't it? Or a rectangle. Oh, there's another one. It should be an E. Should, I bet you it's going to be a rectangle. No, I, I bet think it's, it's an E. Be no. Now, wait. Let's no. see what he's going to do now. I told you it's an E. Well, he's not finished. He'll finish. Well, just a second. Maybe it will be a square. A rectangle. Maybe it'll be a rectangle with a little line in the middle. It's an E. I yeah. think he's done. That's an E. Okay, see? That's a capital E. Yep. Hurry, step right up. C.T. Wordsworth here to show you what it is and where it's at with words. Big ones, small ones, fat ones, and tall ones. And today's word is exit. E-X-I-T. Yes, exit is a very nice... Hey, man, like, let's, let's cut out and bust out of here. What? You know, man, split, blast off. What did you say? You know, split, man, blast off. What? You know, go, man. You dig? What's the matter with you? Oh, you mean to exit. Groovy, baby. Now, it's exes, what I had in mind all the time. Well, I mean, when you said split, Groovy, you know, I, it didn't sound like swoop. exit. Well, I mean, know. get out of here. Well, when something exits, I, I don't know how to relate to you at all. You're such an you old see, person. Talk, I am a young leave. dog, and I know back back all the new things. Exit. Did you hear anything I said? One of the words. Once, some cavemen lived in a cave. Long, long ago, before anything had been invented. Hey, uh, hey, Fred, what time is it? Oh, I don't know. Clocks haven't been invented yet. And the cavemen had a king who loved to play outside. Hi, men. I'm the king. Let's go outside and play, hey? Yeah, let's go. Okay, okay, come on, go. here we go. Here we go. Uh, Ouch. Where's the door? Oh, well, I, I door? can't find oh, it. Oh, oh, my nose. You mean none of us can find the door outside? The cavemen had a problem. Cavemen? Yeah? We have a problem. Yeah. If none of us can find the door outside, we may never play outside again. The king thought. Hmm. And he had an idea. Men, I have an idea. Let us send for the smartest person in the cave, huh? And maybe he can find the door to outside. Listen, you, call for the royal smart person. Okay, uh, hey, call for the royal smart person. Uh, hey, smart person, the king wants you. It is I, the world's greatest smart person. Hey, listen, listen, smart person. We have a problem. You see, none of us can find the door that goes outside. Egad! I have a solution for that problem. Oh, yeah? Yes, my latest invention. Hmm. What is that? Yes, you see... Well, what is that thing you're picking up there? My latest invention is the word exit. You oh. see? Yes. This is an E, this is an X, this is an I, and this is a T. When you put them together, they spell the word exit. Oh, that's wonderful. But uh, how will that help us solve our problem? Elementary, my dear king. We just place this sign above the door. You see, exit means door going out. Oh. Like this. Oh, but you, you were going to but put it over the door. Right 
Here. <gasps> Look at that. But how did you find the door? Uh, elementary. I'm a smart person. Oh, that's oh, wonderful. Boy. Isn't that great, everybody? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, show us how to use it now, huh? Well, first you read the sign over the door. It says E-X-I-T. That spells exit, and that means door going out. Oh, look at him go there. Right. That's wonderful, huh? Yeah. Oh, I'll try that myself. Let's see. It says exit, E-X-I-T. Mm -hmm. And that means door going out. Here I go. Ooh. Wow. Uh, sign says exit means door going out. Oh, boy. And here I go. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, what's the matter? Didn't you read the sign? I don't know how to read yet. Oh, listen, I'll read it for you, see? Look up there, it says exit, E-X-I-T. That means the door going out. Come on. Oh, you're a nice king. Don't you just love my chair? Your chair, huh? It happens to be my chair. It's mine! It's mine! It's mine! It's mine! Please. Please, stop. Let's be sensible about this. Why not simply share the chair? That's fooey. Why don't I learn to keep my mouth shut? Oh, look. There's Bob. He's been playing basketball. And now Bob is going to put his basketball away in his locker. Oh dear, Bob has forgotten which is his locker. Huh? Oh, Bob has remembered something. What is it, Bob? Oh, good. Bob has the key to his locker. Just check what number is on the key and what number is on the locker. Then you'll know which is your locker. It's a three. That's right. Now, which locker number is three? Hmm. Are those two the same? Mm -mm. They're different. Try again, Bob. Well, that's a good try, but those two are different, too. Once more, Bob. That's a good try, but they're still different. They are not the same. Mm-hmm. Try again. That's it, Bob. That's a three on the key and a three on the locker. Now you can put your basketball away. Open the locker. That's right. Oh, no. Tisk, tisk. Bye-bye, Bob, you bozo. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 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 eight. Eight puppets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight puppets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight puppets. 
phase. Octopus's garden near a cave. We would sing and dance around because we know we can't be found. I'd like to be under the sea in an octopus's garden in the shade. Here's the fish again. Yes, I'd be in that garden looking up at the arms of that octopus. An octopus has eight arms. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's a lot of octopus. We would shout and swim about the coral that lies beneath the waves. Here's a clown. Oh, what joy for every turtle boy. I know when they're happy and they're free to leave. We would be so happy, you and me, and no one there to tell us what to do. I'd like to be under the sea in an octopus's garden with you and me. In an octopus's garden with you and me. In an octopus's garden with you. We're looking for a triangle. Now, I see a couple of triangles right there. Do you? Well, hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, you got it. That, but that's only one. Now, uh, do you see another one? Well... Yeah. Right next to it, there's another one. Okay, all right. You got two. Can you see another one? Yeah, you know where they all are. You know where all the triangles are. Hubba, 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 hubba
Eight cents will buy you eight jelly beans or eight candy slices of orange. Eight cents will buy you eight mints of green or eight corny candy corns. Eight penny lollipops, eight lemon drops. Oh, everything looks so grand. From the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight penny candy men. Eight. Hey, all, Kermit the Frog here, and today I'm going to talk to you about pop hey! and. How are you, little froggy? Uh, I was I was fine until you came along. Did you lose something? No, no. But I tell you what, I'm what you today. Doing? Well, I was going to tell you. Oh, okay. Today I'm going to demonstrate top and bottom. And as long as you're here, I suppose you would like to help me. Is that true? Oh, I would do anything to help my little froggy. Okay. Pal, little froggy pal. Uh, yes, right. Yes, what fine. do I do? Well, listen. You know Wait, the difference was... between top and bottom? Top and what? Top and bottom. Uh, Do you know the difference? Is there a difference? Yes, there certainly is. And that's what we're here today to demonstrate. Oh, okay. Now, Grover. Yes. First of all, go over there and bring two of those blocks over yes, there. Yes, sir. No, no, Grover, over this over yes. this way over here. Oh, yes, sir. No, over this way, Grover, I over this way. I'm sorry. Okay, now watch as Grover brings in those two heavy blocks right there. Okay, Grover, just just bring them right over here. The heavy froggy. Oh, that's okay. Now, you all will notice. Uh, uh, stop right there, Grover. Oh, where are you? Yeah, right back here. Oh, okay. Okay, you will notice that the block on the bottom is a plain block. See the block, the block on the bottom there? That's a plain block. And the one on top, the one with stripes on it, that one is on top. You see? That's a striped block on top, a plain block on the bottom. Okay, Grover? Okay, we're now, let's, finished, huh? Uh, no, no. Would you go back over there now and get uh, one more block and put it up on top? Uh, okay, okay. One, one more block. Well, for you, Froggy, okay. one more block. Can you make it? Okay, I think so. Okay. Be right back. No, no. What, what Grover's going to do is put one more block up oh. on top of the other two blocks, you see? Oh. Okay, that's good, Grover. Right. Froggy! Now, oh. now you will notice that the plain block is still on the bottom. The plain block is on the bottom here. Oh. And now the block with the circles oh. on it is up on top. See the block up oh, there? Yeah. The circle's on it. Okay, I, now that's on top. I you put see? them down now, Froggy. No, 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 go well, no, no, Just, just where one more are block. You? I'm over here. Oh, now, listen, yeah. go, go over there and get one more block and put oh, it up on top. Okay? Froggy did so heavy. Okay, just, just one more, okay. Grover. For okay. you, Froggy, for nobody else. Okay. Maybe her, but th that's all. Okay, now uh, you will see that Grover's putting one more block way up on top of oh, the other. Oh, 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 Can you make it, Grover? Okay. Okay, now then, oh. come on out. I'm trying to. Now you will see yeah. that the block with the oh. star on it is now on oh. the top. You see that? Oh. The block up there with the star oh. on it is now on the oh. top. And uh, oh. 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 And uh, uh, Grover is apparently on the uh, <clears throat> bottom. Okay, go uh, Oh, froggy. Uh. Hmm. Would you like to hear another one of my poems? Well, here's one. <clears throat> the Grasshopper by Big Bird. It's me. <clears throat> A grasshopper can jump so high, sometimes I think it's going to fly. But when it comes to earth, why then? It spreads its wings and jumps again. Just watch. Grasshopper.
Well, we're just about ready for our trip, huh? Yeah, we've got everything here. We've got the tennis rackets, and we've got the ball and the glove, and the baseball bat, and socks, and the shirts, and jackets, and pants. It's all here. All right, come on, then. Let's go. Wait, okay. Yeah, you, you, you take this stuff, and I'll take the suitcase. Okay, well. Ralph, wait for me, though. Ralph, what? wait. What? I can't. I, I, I guess I can't take it all. Oh, Wally! Can't you do anything? Oh, look, look, look put, put that stuff down. Here, you put that stuff down. I'll take that stuff, and you take the suitcase. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, Ralph. Okay. Well, I can't take all I can't take all this stuff no. all by myself. Look at all I'm gonna need some help here. Yeah, come on, you better help me. Oh here, me help put that down. Here, you take some of this stuff uh -huh. and I'll take some of it. This is ridiculous. This is, well, it's got to be an easier way yeah, to I do this. So, so. Let me just sit down and think this whole thing over. Because we'll, we'll figure out some way to do this. It's ridiculous. Just let me think a minute. Just a minute. Uh, if, uh... Move over, Ralph. What? Move over. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to Um, let's see. Hey! Uh, this is a pretty good suitcase. It's very comfortable. Oh! Wait a minute! That's it. That's the idea. We'll use the suitcase. We'll use the suitcase to carry that stuff. You think that'll work? Why, of course it'll work. Come on, I'll show you. Come on. Then we won't have any place to sit. Will you get up? Of course that doesn't matter. Now here, you can take this stuff. Hold this. Hold this. Now, put that underneath there. Get the ball. Hurry, put that underneath. Oh, oh. Hurry, yeah, there. Put that right there. There we go. Hold that. Hold your hand here. Wait a second. I have to get the yeah, ball. Get the ball. Yeah, hold that. Uh -huh. Hold that. There we are. Now you get that in. Get that in. This? I'll get this in. This? Oh. And here we go. <laughs> well, you're smart, you know? True. Very true. He pensado mucho en un pensamiento. He pensado en pensar. He pensado mucho en eso. Luego pensé más. ¿Y saben qué? Creo que pensé un pensamiento. ¡Un pensamiento! Este pensamiento es un círculo. ¿En cuántas cosas que parezcan un círculo pueden pensar? Allí está una rueda y un plato. Una moneda es un círculo. Y también un botón, una señal de alto y una señal de siga, una galleta, una claraboya, el sol y una lata. Esperen, una lata no es un círculo. A mí me parece un círculo. Exit. Exit.
gets it. <gasps> Cookie! Oh boy, cookie for me, huh? Yeah, thank you. Oh, you eating cookie? Cookie not for me. Oh, oh cookie for me? You put it on table for me. Oh, thank you. Oh, cookie not for me. Cookie for you. Oh, cookie for me! Oh boy, cookie! Get cookie on! Oh, oh boy, you like cookie too? A chocolate cookie? You know what? You getting dressed all dirty? Give the cookie to me. Me no care if me fur get dirty. Oh, you still eating cookie, huh? Look delicious. Hey, 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 got terrific idea. You eat cookie. When you finished, me give you a big kiss and the cookie off face, okay? Uh, no, huh? Hey, I tell you what, you come home with me and we eat cookies all day. Got closet full of cookies. Yeah! Oh. <clears throat> Behind me, there are two doors, here and here. And the letter E is above both of the doors. See him, huh? Do ya? All right. I'll bet you're wondering what those two letter E's are doing up there. Don't you? Huh? Well, E is a very important letter because it is the first letter in the word enter. And it's the first letter in the word exit. So you see, the letter E is very... That's enough, Roy. Well, kids, that's it. The letter E. Stop it, Roy. Roy, you're really weird. We're looking for a rectangle. Now, you uh, got to find a rectangle for me. I know you, you can see that rectangle. Come on. Mm, yeah. Go ahead, now. I'm watching you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's it. You got it. It's a rectangle. Now, uh, erase that. Yeah. Now, let me see a circle. Find me a circle. Go ahead. Uh-huh. A circle. Well, you started out right. Yeah, go. Mm-hmm. A circle. That's a good circle. All right, now, erase that one. Erase that one. All right, now, where's the other circle? Yeah. Two circles and a rectangle. E. E. L. Eel. Chomp, 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 chomp. Chomp, 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 chomp. Chomp, 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 chomp. E. Do you know the alphabet? You know the alphabet, I know the alphabet too. I know it starts with A. And then I get lost. Can you help me? What happens after A? B. B, and then after that? C. Yeah. D. Yeah. E. Yeah. F. Yeah. What comes after F? What comes after F? I know what comes after F. You ready? Oh, yeah. What's that? G. Ah, G comes after F. What comes after G? Well, I think I have another answer. How about that? What's that? H. H, H. Very good. Okay. Then what? H, I, J. Then what? K. L. L. Yeah. 
I know it's not easy. M. Hmm? M. L M. N. N. O. 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 What comes after O? O. We can do it. We can do it. What comes after O? P. 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 Very good. P. Uh. Q. Q. R. R. Is that right? R. And uh, S. 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 T. T. U. U. We're getting there. What comes after you? V. V comes after you. U. V. W. W. X. X. I think we're going to do it. What comes next? Y. And then what? Z. Oh. We did it! Sesame Street has been brought to you today by the letters E and W, and by the number 8. Sesame Street is a production of the Children's Television Workshop.